Hey, what's up guys? It's Fusion and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get invisible apps on your iPhone. So guys, before we hop in, just drop a like and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. I would love to get to 4,000 before the summer of 2020, guys. Please help me reach that goal and drop that subscribe. Anyways, guys, let's hop into it. So as you guys can see, I have invisible apps or I have the effect of invisible apps where you cannot see the apps but they are really there the first thing you guys want to do is come onto google images and look for a solid background so something like solid blue background would work and this image right here would work perfectly and you want to find one that's a little bit vertical so it fits your phone screen better and isn't super stretched out so like this one for an example this is perfect it's solid i'm going to add this to my photos next find the photo in your photo library and i recommend adding this as a favorite because you're going to need this image for later on but for now just set it as your home screen wallpaper you can do this by hitting the little box with the arrow and then coming down to use as wallpaper turn off perspective zoom click set and then set home screen now when we come back you guys can see how this trick really goes so what you guys are going to want to do is come into the app store and you're going to want to download something called shortcuts i guess they have this weird thing for it but you just want to come here and somehow download shortcuts once you have it open it up and you'll be on this screen you want to click create shortcut now you want to click add action and you want to click on scripting next you want to choose open app when you select open app, you're now going to click here on choose and you are going to choose an app to technically open when you press the invisible thing on your screen. So guys, pretty much, I think you understand the illusion so far. Technically, these aren't invisible. These, when I actually tap them, open up this stupid little bacon game that I downloaded off the app store and you flip the bacon onto whatever the object is. So for our action we're creating now, we need to choose an app that you wouldn't mind opening by accident. So I recommend one like settings, because settings is really easy, it opens fast, and who cares. Next you want to click next. Now guys, this is the tricky part. For the name, it has to be invisible, but you can't just put spaces. In the description, I'm going to have a link for you guys to get some invisible characters for iPhone. For me, I have these just invisible characters and I can paste them in right here and click done. All right. So now that we have the invisible characters here, we have everything set. It's going to open up settings. The last thing we're going to do, guys, is click add to home screen. When you click this, all you want to do is tap down here and click choose photo. Now you want to find your solid image and click choose. And last, click add. When you go back to your home screen, you won't find your app because it's invisible. And now you guys can see how the magic works. So pretty much guys, you can do anything you want with this. You can make a big layout like I have. You can literally, the possibilities are endless. And when I put my image on, you can see how the effect works. So guys, if this helped you, make sure to drop a like on the video, subscribe, and turn on post notifications because I know I haven't been uploading a lot, but I'm coming back, guys, and I'm going to be uploading a lot more stuff. I'm going to be uploading some cool stuff on iPhone, some stuff on consoles, computer. I'm just going to be really trying more, guys, because I feel like I've left you guys, and I really do not like that. I will always love my fan base, and I thank you guys so much for all your support. If you guys do want to keep in touch with me besides on my YouTube channel though, follow my Instagram at Fusion here and follow my Twitter at Fusion here. All the links are in the description and I'm going to start posting pictures on Instagram. I'm going to start DMing you guys, so hit me up. Anyways guys, thank you so much and I'll catch you guys next time. And guys, before you go, remember God loves you. Go look up John 316 right now.